this is a mongrel of a Tysco neck and some other Japanese body. Could be Shinto, could be Tysco, could be Fujigen. I don't know. Doesn't matter. It is solid wood, it's not plywood. It's a smaller body, but it's 24 and a half inch scale because of that's what the neck scale is. And I don't know what the original scale would have been. I have a feeling it was originally a, a shorter short, shorty short, like 23, something like that. But I, I only got it with the body. So it works great. It's one of those uh, multi-laminate, Tysco Kawai necks that are indestructible and it's perfectly straight as they all are. I gave it a new 12 inch radius and new Jess Car 47104 frets, new bone nut, new modern tuners. Um, the body, like I said, is it's solid wood, which would be Philippine mahogany or Luan. And it's uh it's really nice i mean it's it's got my pickups on here the p90s which are voiced for each position so this one's extra nasty and this one's a little bit warm and they hum cancel when they're played together now, now the weird thing about this body shape is it's not really uh, your jag wire jag jazz master whatever those things are it's it's not really a copy of that it's more of a, a copy of a bobcat right which i find very odd and unusual and just the idea that the japanese were copying a bobcat maybe bobcat was copying i don't i don't know i know this is definitely american made and this is definitely japanese odd isn't it and it's the same size as uh, as a bobcat, whereas a you know a fender thing would be a bigger honking body on it. I gave it a new pick plate. It got new new pots, and the bridge on here is one of my Dan Electro style heavy um, aluminum bridge, which works great on these things. This is a brilliant design that the. Um, Dan Electro came up with and it doesn't get any consideration it doesn't get much respect because typically the the bridge saddle is made out of wood on those which is like yeah that's kind of a cheese out this has got an aluminum one and being a high mass plate on there it, it's a great bridge now, before you get all excited about, well, well, it doesn't have full contact on the body. And yeah, well, your Les Paul is up on two little spindly posts. So that whole theory is, I don't buy that theory, especially on something like this. Okay. The other question I get is, well, why don't you put a hardtail on there? Well, because hardtails are too wide. This is a narrow, this is your typical Japanese narrowness that they have in a hard tail spread is too wide so you'll see people try to do that all the time and then the string is like hanging off the not even on the neck it's like you can't do that you've got to come up with a solution to match the geometry this i make these i have these machined for me so that i can fit them on a more narrow width spread they're built for to fit exactly on a on a dano but you know, why not use them? That's my attitude. I got them. I'm going to use them. I, and I like them. I think they look good. They work great. So there you have it. Tysco Mongrel P90 Slash and Burn.